All right, everybody, welcome back. Round two, Operation Mistwalker, Squad Ops One Life event going on tonight, August 19th, 2017. My name is Muff Bandit. I'm here with Expit, guy who actually made this operation. What was the main goal of this operation that you made? What was the angle? Yeah. Uh, I like the layer. It's the it's kind of a darker layer and a more infantry focused. I thought that would be interesting, kind of uh, to do a kind of single objective, right? Both teams are kind of after the same thing, so kind of sets them up to be able to play out differently and they have a chance for uh, engagements anywhere on or off the objective. And both teams can use the river to their advantage. So. You know, it's kind of opened up, opened it up. So we'll see what happens. And that was kind of the angle. <laughs> yeah, and you really did just throw them down on a kind of an even playing field, saying get at it and come out on top, outplay your opponent type of thing. It's yeah, a really I mean, cool operation. I really dug it. I I got to play in the first event today, and I'll tell you what, it was a blast. Man, at first glance, it kind of looks like oh well, one team's obviously going to get there first every time, but it, it's not true. Because the uh, they can't you know have to use the bridges, so if the militia uses that southern bridge, it becomes a choke point, and or if they use the the, the railroad bridge, you know the Russians can see eyes on it. They get there about the same time, but they both sprint there. And the southern bridge is kind of in cover, but as soon as they cross it and get on the other side, the Russians can have eyes on them. So it becomes kind of a chess match as to see who's going to get there first and have the uh, fire superiority to break their way out of it. Oh, yeah, and it could be interesting. I, I know earlier today we saw control bounce back and forth for a minute between the two teams. So that's really cool to see. It depends how you position your troops and where you want to allocate your resources. You can put a few on the point, but if it gets overrun, all of a sudden you have to become the offense again, push. Mm -hmm. So it's this is going to be awesome. And I know both squad leaders, or both commanders, Karma Cut and Shadow Ritual, were paying attention each other and they are going to have some interesting strategies this time i bet and that's cool i want to thank everyone for coming out and watching we're doing a giveaway end of the month every month get signed up you'll see it pop up in the twitch chat uh maybe other chats i wish i had the other chats open let's see ant find it Darn it. Oh, look, here they come. Oh, well. Oh, there they popped up. All right, anyway, this is Russia against Militia. They're all going for the same location, India 9, keypad 4. There's kind of a main compound in there that they're going to be going for. Round of it. Bravo, get pretty. Yep, here we go. Platoon briefing coming up. Why am I seeing that gun? Blue this time is Militia again. Don't look at me. Don't look at me. But Don't it's different me. command. It's Shadow oh, Ritual okay. commanding this time. You're in the other fire team. Pretty lines. Get over there. Nice. Oh my god. I hate Mikosh. You're not in my fire team. Oh, you squad. Uh, your, your fire team must be Mikosh. Mikosh. Yes, I am. Your Shadow, get in the middle. You can't have two medics in one fire team. team. Sorry. All right, guys. Give me comms. Give me comms. You. Welcome to round two of Operation Miss Walker. Good job last round. Uh, we'll see if we can beat him this round. I think, I don't know. Well, we should have beaten him, I think. But it was close. It was a fun round. Fucking uh, confidence in this guy. It. The uh, mm -hmm. plan is as follows. Squad one, Pony squad, will be taking the south uh, bridge. And they're not going to be crossing immediately. They're just going to make a show of force and draw some attention down that way. And they're going to either maneuver north after that or cross, depending on the, uh, the type of contact they take. Squad 2, squad, squad two, 3, and 4 will be taking the north bridge. Squad 2 will cross the north bridge and head into Neva Lower towards the uh, BTR mark. And then just sit tight and let the, uh, the enemy team pass them. Once the enemy team passes them, they're going to come in on their flank. Squad 3 will be holding the hill area, the mountain area, I guess it's a hill, near the, uh, the sniper mark. And then trying to prevent them from crossing the bridge uh, from uh, from that area. Squad 4 will be heading to the objective proper, and we'll be watching, and I'll be with them, we'll be watching the objective proper, and we'll be watching the south flank, where uh, Squad 3 last time was able to uh, sort of just get right up on the actual objective. Are there any questions? 
Hoorah, that's the way to do it. Cool. If there are no uh, further questions, squad leads break them out for final details. I'll call the letter. All right, boys. My shovel's rusty. Can I get a new one? No. You ready, no. boy? You ready, boy? You ready, boy? Dad, where are you? All right, back in. We just heard Shadow Ritual give the brief. And if you didn't figure out what he was talking about, send in one squad up in the new lower to try and flank the Russians. If they can get up there before him and let the Russians sneak past, they'll come in behind and flank. He's got one squad actually staying on this side of the river, moving uh, move up to that green so kind of fob marker on the left side here. Kind of on the, let's see, kind of right here. They're going to go there and do everything they can to keep them from crossing this bridge. Scare them away. Scare them away. Push them up north. Keep them out of their, out of their hair where they almost got in in the south. Of them. So another squad's going straight to the objective proper. I'm not quite sure what the other one was. I, I didn't quite hear it. I bet you they're just going to push through and kind of be a distraction. So that's what Militia's going to do. Try to get to the objective quick. Get their guys in position. Maybe not do a wall like last time, like we saw from Militia last time, but more of a flank and sideswipe type of technique. So this would be cool. We are going to go to the Operation Overlay really quick, show you guys what's going on. It's really cool. First, we'll go over what assets each team gets. And... Both teams actually get two ARs and two medics per squad. So a lot of extra medics today. Usually there's only one medic per squad. They get two today, which means they can take a few more shots. It's infantry only. They can handle it. Uh, once they get to that compound in India 9 keypad 4, the designated compound, they can put a fob there, which they can defend. Now, that's only going to give them about 200 extra points, so it's not going to be too bad. But as for that compound, it's an India 9 keypad 4. It's infantry only. They've got to use bridges they can't cross the river uh they got to assault the fortified location uh the first one there can drop a fob they can build in placements they infantry can use their sandbags but i mean it's a hold and fight until the last man time limit there's no nothing um they, they will definitely be encouraged People will definitely be encouraged to push if they're sitting there on the other side of the river while half the other enemy team is holding them do we get a live no, no, Sounds like a lot of folks are ready. Or at least the militia side. Don't know about Russia yet. Yeah, you're on Tedish's. Got a lot of different things over there on the Russian side. And I don't know if we have a camera on that side. Who knows? Yeah, but I have gotten in four, so I do have five, five, six. So we'll keep waiting, we'll hang out here for a second. I do have five, five, Rush will be ready soon. Good work. I'm proud of you. Yeah, it's a simple enough operation, but there's a lot of detailed planning that goes into it from both sides. So Helomek just recently asked who won round one, and a crazy Russian said militia. And Helomek said, is that typical on this op, or is this one pretty 50-50? Well, that's a good question. But today is the, the debut of this operation, Operation Mistwalker. So this is the first time it's been played by anybody uh, in, as a public event, uh, which is interesting, because right now it's 2-1 to one Russia. So we'll see how 50-50 it is after, at the end of today. Uh, Russia was 1-2, Militia's 1-1. And this could get interesting. We'll see. I expect yeah. Militia to rush the point and get fortified real quick and early. It looked like it worked for him last time. And we'll see if it works again. Yeah, I mean, I think only one team has a slight advantage on this map. I'm not going to say which side, but it plays out different every single time. I think in the in the EU session, the first session we did the, earlier today, uh, militia kind of held off a little bit they were like we'll let the russians come in lower them in a little bit then yeah they might have paid for it because of that yeah and then and then when karma cut was commanding on the militia side he decided to do the south bridge rush which worked out so that wasn't a rush we stopped and waited i was i was in the lead squad in that that was crazy it was a gauntlet we got up there i, had, I actually had to play dead at the end of the bridge while i was bandaging myself 
And but we learned a lot about that. And I think that that train bridge is totally a viable option. So my, it's it's doable. There's almost there's a bunch of possibilities for advancing across the bridge, gaining position, stuff like that. Yeah, it's kind of like any bridge push in any of our opposites. If you gain the fire superiority, you can definitely yeah. push a lot of guys across it. You sure can, yeah. I mean, that railroad bridge does have some uh, some cover on it, but once you get to the west side of it, there's like no cover. That's why the militia typically, if they're going to cross, they cross on that southern bridge. It seems like they got that somewhat of a good cover once they cross over against the rock wall, but Russia can meet them there. Yeah, that train bridge is extremely dangerous, and I'm surprised how successful we were earlier today crossing, but I wouldn't recommend doing it again. Yeah, I was the uh, squad so to, Yeah, I was the squad to the northwest, and I had a real hard time watching you guys once you uh, hit the end of the bridge. You got into the defilade here. We can see you. Like, but what if Shadow would anticipate that I will anticipate that he will anticipate that I will anticipate that it's just fucking back and forth. Jeez. I'm not sure what's going on on the Russian side. I'm sure Should they're doing I a long briefing or something, but Russia's ready. we're just going to hang out for a second. <laughs> Maybe we'll see if Russia's ready. It sounds like they're getting antsy on the malicious but, uh, side. They're going to ask. Uh, um, I don't, there's not too much planning that can really go into it. No, he's well, calling for... That's the thing. For infantry ops, I always, like, think about the flank. So here's what he's doing. I, I, like, go back to... I know exactly what he's doing. Here's a view of that northern bridge that they that they can use to cross into the uh, the objective area. Are you okay? Fine. There we go. Oh my god, dude, this fucking lifetime. We're getting it. Hang on. Oh, we've got the Russian Russia ready call. Ready. We'll be live in about a minute and a half, I'm guessing. Or 30 seconds. Live 144. No, we did. Now Russia, or now, yeah, now Russia called it, and now it's live at 144. Hold on. No, it's not. It's not actually live. Not actually live. Definitely ready. They're already in their formations. Squad say, separated. Say again. What is so? Now another minute added to the ready time. So we get a second. Right. Why did you lie to me, bro? Uh, These men said to speak that now. Four, two, three. Uh, 80 meters, and yeah, I'm I can hear you. Lower. Hello? I don't know if I can trust you anymore. I was Jump trying to test it. You way. can hear for a pretty long way, I have to say. We are live in 50 seconds. How many meters is each one of those spares in the map? The little, little... Uh, Anybody's uh, watching us for the first time, this is uh, Squad Ops. Uh, we run one life events uh, through the game of Squad. Medics can heal you, but they cannot revive you. I wish you could hear the enemy. Whatever ammo you leave with is what you got for the entire operation. That would be awesome. Should we play out to the last man? Every other branch, every branch in it. Live in about 15 seconds. You can go see him. Yeah. Pitta -pitta, yeah. mostly straight north. Besides, save this one squad. And we'll follow. Rush is all lined up. Looks like they're doing a uh, column, column formation. Militia are running and organized chaotic for them. <laughs> kind of a swarm, if you will. As you guys are watching, you, you'll see that some guys are blue, some guys are red. Well, the blue guys are on the same team, they're militia. Red guys are on the same team, they're Russian. So we made it simple. Myself and Xbit are on the same team. So we're both on militia, so they're going to be blue. So so every time you guys see blue, it'll be Russian. Or I'm sorry, it'll be militia. And every time you see red, it'll be Russian. 
And that's actually going to work out the whole way because all our cameras are on militia this time too. So you're going to see blue for militia, red for Russian all night. A lot of militia just pushing on forward. I've been working on the railroad. They're not holding back any any talking in local, that's for sure. Yeah, you'll see us bouncing around to some uh, first person views too. I think we're on Google Tricks right now. It's on the Russian team. Your left, your left, your left, right, left. I'm just kidding. Now we're on Tedish. Actually, right now you can hear the Silverman. You can hear command in local comms. From pre-op comms to battle comms. For militia. Basically. Not both teams. Can't hear any squad comms. We're, we're going to, we're doing fine now. We're far enough away. It'll be fine. Basically, once we cross the bridge, though, everyone will... I'm like a soldier in the midst of them. I'm running, except I'm an Olympic sprinter. I'm a little faster. Look at me go. Yeah, but when you look around at like eye level like this, you get a feel of how many guys are actually here covering you. Look how many. Look at how many people got your back. You know, like look at this. There's more, and there's even more. And if I go farther, I'm even gonna pass a couple more. Catch him and say. Russia was moving as one giant formation, but it looks like they're starting to split off their teams now. In the distance, you can see the, the blue guys. Those are the militia. Use your sandbags how you see fit, two and uh, three, four, we're going to use them in the uh, objective. You still want us around this rock, right? Yeah, 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 get, uh, command, you know what you have? Command to that hilltop. Militia are breaking Don't, out now, they're spreading out. We're not going to hold strong there, you're just going to delay them Copy. from there. Copy! You're going to fall back to that. So are we using there. sandbags? Yeah, use your sandbags there. Okay. I'd like your sandbags being there. Yeah, it looks like one. Russia's kind of split up their forces. They did two squads on the north and two squads on the south of the railroad tracks. They're going to have eyes on these uh, these militia off the, the east here. Looks like the militia are, are displacing, though. Militia are almost at the compound. There's a minute or two out. They're taking the same hills last time. They've got some guys up there. Russia not very close yet. Russia more concerned with the railroad bridge. They have got two full squads, it looks like, up on the rocks to the southwest of the railroad bridge. Definitely concerned about that. And they've got these two squads here. They're moving one almost direct to the uh, bridge. Another squad that's breaking off to the northwest here or northeast. Yep, they're laying in wait, hoping that the militia will cross the bridge, but I don't think they are. Command, are you 
No, and I don't think the militia have any orders to cross that bridge. They're just making sure the Russians don't cross. Look yep. at the Russians. A lot of them prone. So many of them are just laying there prone, waiting for orders, watching, waiting, covering that bridge. Cool. Put your sandbags where you want them. I count one radio. In the meantime, militia's getting a nibble here. lower. They've got a full squad in here, kind of laying in the fields, crawled through. It looks like building. Yeah, they've established Duck. the frog at the fortification. Um, I don't think he can respawn. Yep. Okay. We haven't okay. taken contact yet, so. Uh, yeah. Tedish, is there president for that? I thought the rule was per squad. You heard Muff. Sorry, where do you want me to put the Sorry, I didn't hear him at all. If you can get in before contact, drop the rally. Check the Russians are all clumped up on this hilltop. You can see the uh, militia out in the back there. They're pretty well dispersed. Yeah, the militia just... are. They're all oh. positioned for the most part, aren't they? Yeah, we got some fire going on. Set down by the bridge. I don't think it's aimed at anything in particular. Oh, there it is. It's across the railroad bridge. Probably firing at that. That'll be a three. Are they engaging on U3? Please take them in contact. Three. So right now I hear Best Pony saying we're, we're getting shot at, but they're not hitting anything. So that railroad bridge is the tactics working. They're getting shot at, but they're not. They're not they have no intention of crossing. Surprised nobody's gotten hit. It's like three squads putting suppression on them. Oh, yeah. I'm sitting here watching tracers fly back and forth. But the, for now, Best Pony squad's doing fine. Squad one for the militia. Doing great. Great. Shoot for the tracers, gentlemen. That's how you find them. Nobody's moving. No. Nope. They're all just sitting there, hanging out. Militia do have the point, though. Tedish has his guys in Neva Lower. They're looking west. Yeah. They're the flank squad. Probably quiet. nothing going on there, though. So just to clear, Russia's not pushing right at all. Who are these guys? Just to clarify, about? since I haven't taken contact, can I spawn? Uh, yeah. yeah, it's a person. It's moving. Yep, yep, yep. Oh, I'm taking a shot. I don't want you to all of their guns are pointed at me. They are emptying their fucking magazines in this direction. I've got two oh, casualties. Yeah, they're they're now. chewing they're through right. all their ammo. Right. Uh, can I get barracks? There's two there. there. Two there. On the tracer. Three. Do you see these? Yeah, I see him. They're, they're there, on those tracers. That's me firing, guys. Just, yeah, just hold fire. We're, we're spotting, guys. We got Binox and we're spotting people for other squads. Militia firing back a little bit. Nothing too hectic going on. No, I think I suppressed because I hit the wall. Seems like this is going to be more of a uh, cat and mouse no, kind of session. Russia's pushing across oh, the uh, British yeah, south. Yeah. Gutsy. Quite gutsy, I do say. There's some more militia fire from the north. Got a little tracer fire going for that two man squad or two squad team. That squad looks like it's made it across the south bridge. At least made contact with this militia squad over here. They did. It looks more like a fire team. Not very many of them, is there? Nope. One, how are you doing? Uh... Looks like the Russians have killed one. 
I'm not sure who, but they got some. See a lot of movement by this Russian team. I'm gonna go over here see if I can't catch him. Looks like one of them's pushing in, one of them's falling back. Oh, they're gonna go. They're gonna flank even lower. Yeah, that looks like they might go for a far flank, huh? Yeah, but northern flank eventually. They are. You are. They might be. We saw a, a whole squad right, fall so back. Tedish is reporting it. Tedish is saying, I think some of them fall back really west. So they might be running uh, around. My position They're fully position aware. Good road. job by militia paying attention, but not shooting. Russia doesn't know we're there. Russia is still there. Gonna need it lower. Got this flanking squad going around. Around, move. Along the, who they got running the show there with them, huh? Oh, sightless, leading the way. Yeah, that's not accurate at all. Just stop fire, cease fire, cease fire, cease fire. That's not going anywhere near what you're shooting at. Just take cover, take cover. Oh, they're pissed. Yeah, this one you see where the traces squad is are coming from? The brunt of the you weren't, shots, it's weird. Your sure. saw wasn't even coming. In the meantime, a full squad for Russia's cross the railroad bridge. And they didn't cross the railroad bridge, they crossed like the vehicle bridge south of it. Yep. Now that militia squad on the other side split up into two fire teams, one to the south of them, one to the east. And they've moved the full squad across the bridge now. No casualties for Russia yet. Two for the militia. Yeah, copy that. Dave, we seen them moving around. But we don't know where. You know, a lot of both teams are, for the most part, unaware of the other team's location. It's just a game of maneuver now. A lot of Russian fire going on towards the militia, though. Yeah. yeah. That one squad that set up in the middle there on that high ground has got pretty good view of everything on the map. Plenty of shoot. All right, three. That squad is sweeping around to the north. Copy. Oh, Teddy's called that squad. Right, we're gonna go sweep north. those guys yeah, up and hit him in the back. We know to be shoot. ready. Go behind them. North of us. I'm seeing him yeah, somehow. I think he's in that building here. I think Teddy's is gonna get his guys to try and flank the flanking squad. That'll be good. That'll be awesome. They'll never see it coming. Right, Sightless two, guys coming gonna, in on Teddy's. We're gonna flank their direct flank. Direct north. Oh yeah, there it is. Yeah, Tedish just said it. We're gonna right, counterflank their flank. Quiet until right. <laughs> it's game of maneuvers. We still got at least three or four guys on top of that hill. Uh, Tedish, Hopefully they don't expose themselves too too there. bad on oh, that yeah, uh, more than half of it. Tedish has got his guys halfway there already. This is they're just burning through their whole platoon's ammo on my positions, right? That sounds good. Three, how's your uh, position? Pretty well, taking pause shots, but we're okay. Running a bit low on ammo. Tell them to watch sure the guy. Tell them to watch their ammo. A lot of gunfire scenes right here. Weapons with free... Very well, poor no, accuracy. Weapons tight unless you which have is to. just fine. Again, same rules unless Thanks you can for get a bunch of kills at once. For some good protect. Four, there's some death blade on the southwest of this peninsula. All right, Tedis has got six dudes here, five of them. Protection They've got the a good east. flank coming up on these Russians as long as they don't get too far east, east, east to their south the there. I'm on this hill here. Look east Tedish. Tedish has got the right idea if he can get his guys to follow him. Oh, they're coming in. These two of them oh, yeah. together. Wow, there's three oh, oh Tedish can open up. Here we go. Okay, wow. It's yep. going okay, to get ready, dirty. Ready? Is he going to throw an aid? Lead with that ready? nade, baby. You got to lead with that nade. Oh, there they go. One down. Tedish down. So far, they're trained at one for one. Oh, good nade. Someone's down with from that nade. That Russian squad's pretty surrounded. They're spreading out, scattering like ants. So there are a... Ooh, 
rough. I think we've got three, three and three for this exchange. Someone's talking, but he's all by himself. Let's see how this nade does. Is he gonna get somebody? No, he threw away. Too. Well, that Russian push on the south has taken out half of Best Pony's guys here. Best Pony himself is down. All right, one one Russian's got back behind him. This guy's gonna get the flank. Up on the hill. It's coming hard. Keevan's gonna get the flank. Od tap goes down. Here comes Keevan. Two. Oh, they heard Keevan coming. He was too loud. We're trying to flank flank a northern squad that's coming around here. No contact. The southern squad is now doing some maneuvers. They're flanking off the bridge to the south to clear it off. Looks like there's only one left for this squad and digits coming through to clear him out a little bit. Good engagement. Both these squads only got a couple guys. Hey, don't let the hey tell them not to get in the river. Don't get in the river. You can't get in the river. I'm sure Digit heard that shot above him. Oh yeah, he's heading up the hill. Oh. Uh, he's not in the river. He, it's just his marker and Okay. This guy's digit, he's alive, oh, and then this is the enemy oh, who's still alive right here. Ragal oh, the Don Don. Oh, is Digit gonna walk up behind him? He's in the bush. Digit won't see him. Oh, Digit sees him, shoots him right in the booty. He's dead. So that one flank squad is done at the cost of a hefty cost to this squad, but they've still got a few guys left. Oh, and it's not over for this squad. They're still getting shot at from the rest of the Russian forces to their southwest here. South. Squad is pushed off of that hill that was firing on uh, one's position and is moving east. Two, they're moving right for you. So I need you to move east, hit that road, and push south and meet up with three. Three, you're going to need to watch your, your uh, southwest soon. Sounds like uh, Shadow's handing out some commands there. Meanwhile, the Russians oh, are also consolidating their troops to a different direction. So both commanders are kind of like uh, one remaneuvering just themselves. Just south of you, one. There should be a, you should, it should be like a Yeah, they're adjusting hill. to what each other's done. up on that hill in, uh, in hiding. In, hiding and for the most for part, pass you. Shadow Ritual is like, we got the point, let's fall plane. back, let's no guard it. Yeah. I'm not sure what Karma's doing, he's probably Don't saying, fire, well, let's hold, hold regroup, push some more. A lot of Russians left, though, let's check it out. 12 to 10, so the militia's barely got the, the lead. Kills, but there's a a lot of soldiers left on both teams. A lot of spread on both teams. One or two good wipes by one side could sway the match really hard. Disconnected. I don't. He, I mean, that's not always true. Sometimes the, the fire team lead doesn't want the AR. But yeah, I I, I don't. I think Pony passed it down. Do you have Just so I had. Just so. So the Belarusian Russians are still exchanging fire. It looks like that squad that was up on that knoll is still taking fire. Um, both yeah, teams are kind of, re stopped. yeah. I mean, they're both kind of repositioning. The Jack just to get to that fortress, and the militia are holding it right now. So we're just trying to outmaneuver them. Maybe the uh, fortress is just middle to the right there, with a the little collection of uh, L shape. Is the objective? No, no, they're gonna pull back. They're they're a command down, and they don't have their actual home squad. Two, you're gonna pull back to us. You're gonna pull back to us. There's a there's a compound on the north of the four that I, I want you to hold. And up command in. sitting right in the middle of that fortification. There's a compound on the north of four that I, I want you to hold up. We haven't in. seen much Three of it yet, but all these in. infantry can but use sandbags. They can place sandbags and dig them up. Uh, some of them have done it on this hill over here. I'm kind of hovering above, but. 
Man, if these guys knew there was that many Russians over there, they'd be a little less likely to shoot at him, probably. But I'd do it too. I would shoot at him. Hey, if it's like, a I got the shot, I can hit this. Bang, bang, bang. Shoot at them before they shoot you back, right? Plenty of shots going out. Yeah, but both the... This ops is kind of a real strain on the ammo for both teams. It really is. It really is. There's no jumping in a vehicle and getting closer, bailing out. There's none of that. There's no vehicles. Not even a lodging. Speaking of ammo, Shadow Ritual's doing an ammo on check ammo? right now. One. I know three is hurting. Uh, hold on, let me check. Shoot, what's your ammo count? I know four has to be fucking all green. There, there's a little speculation on how much the Russians have wasted. How much, anime, how much ammo is the Russians with? You know, they were sitting there suppressing for a long time. I'm hearing some of these guys say they're, you know, they're down to a magazine is all they've got. They can't. Provide any more suppression. <laughs> They'll run out of yeah, ammo. The, the building digits coming up too. That's so it's almost a war of attrition in. right now. That compound should be good. How much ammo have they got? How long? And watch our, uh, what, uh, Southwest. I bet they were wishing they had those melee shovels now, right? Some melee shovels. <laughs> yeah. Right around the corners. Got it. Russia's creeping around on these rocks trying to get eyes on. Some militia out there, you can see them just laying down there on that little island by the river. Yeah, it's very slow. Turned into a slow match right now. Is command still up for... Oh yeah, command's up for both teams. And there's there's Shadow Ritual reminding his guys don't don't get antsy we're on the point they have to come to us. They gotta dig us out. I'm 100 percent sure I'm on the right. There's some shots across the water actually. Oh, and the militia's in the wide open. They're pretty wide open. Rush is up on the bridge. Oh yeah, a few guys down. Yeah, to those little island guys. We're in a bad spot. Couple of, yeah, a couple of them went down. A couple of militia went down. Okay. So we just sent a medic out there to die. That spot now. Okay, bro, uh, Brzinger, bring your guys back. Everybody back. Everybody back. We've got a lot of contact. Russia is just giving it to this little southern fire team down here. It sounds like Google lost three or his entire alpha fire team on that one. Yeah, he did. They took a beating up there. At least three guys lost.
a little hit by the Russians on him. Sounds good. Yep. But yep. still, Russia's Russians got so many guys spread out. They're so far spread out. All right, now they got a lot of work to do. Copy. Nobody make a move unless you have to. Okay, we're keeping our guys. And Shadowed right, is preaching. Forward. Copy. Nobody make a move unless oh. you have to. Okay? He's, been, he's preaching. Our guys Stay here. Tight. See. Especially us two and make four. Push we're you. not Stay close. Be patient. They need a pullback. But right now, we're, yep. we have the advantage. Okay, guys. We have the advantage. We're not going to try and take more than we need. And a good job by Militia. They're just hanging back. Well, they realize pushing out hurt. They actually lost another guy pushing out. Who it is. Yeah, they they're in good cover right now. Cross that open. Oh, okay. How many did you lose? Freaking like, I think I lost three. You lost four. Four. Three or four, yeah. Let's see. One, two, three, four. Yeah, I lost four. I lost a fire team, effectively. Did I lose Brizinger too? Plenty of time left. Yeah, I lost my alpha. Yeah, you're not going to hear Russia comms. We're trying to do it so it's easier to tell what team you're watching. Yeah. That's why we stay on the same side. No. So when you see us, it's all blue for the same side. It gets confusing. Yeah, we switch back and forth a lot, so it's, it's a little easier for both on the same colors. Yeah, and usually we've got more cameras, so you'd have comms on both teams, but we're short cameras. Looks like we got Jack Reynolds' squad here. He's uh, he's moving them up the riverside here on the south. Well, are they going to push across the river soon? No, they're actually going to stay on the north side. They're gonna looks like they're going to be the uh, squad that assaults the fortification. Ah. And you've got another Russian squad way up to the north there. Yeah, push it back around again, north. All right, they're pushing back towards uh, tra train. Bridge. Good spacing. Copy. Try and pull that squad. Them. Good job there. Good, good, good spacing. I've got eyes on us. Your weapon's a free one. You can start getting fire shots on them. Still pretty close, right? It looks like there's a lot of Score militia one? still up. Uh, yeah, 14 to 13 for kills, so it's anybody's match. Militia's got their guys spread out a little bit. Russia's got their guys spread out a little bit. Can you send a fire team that has good ammo north and keep a lower to swing west? Or is that a nobody yeah. team? Yeah, you're in a... Shadow Ritual just asked someone to head north and a lower and swing west. They might want to swing east. All right, now Let's see what happens. We got one or two of them. Copy that one. Got a few guys on these rocks, but whole squad pushing in their street. Most part, it's a wedge. Maybe. One, keep trying to move west. Yeah, I like, I like that. Keep trying to move. Mm. I like that. Keep trying to move west and get them on the train bridge. Keep, uh, four is putting down suppression fire on that bridge. Maybe. Yeah, slow around. and steady. Slow and steady. I don't want to use up ammo. I think I killed command. Nice. It was just a well, solo dude with binoc running around, Down you know, like karma. Uh, where do you want them after the yep. Gonna come up on Odessa's squad here pretty soon. Yeah, they might. They got a little ways to go. I gotta be getting right, low on ammo team though. Pushing straight north into this this entire squad. Now, if anything, they're gonna want to stay Are on the side of the road. The oh, they're you? about to get shot. Then cover me they're, they're, he's totally seen. He's got to be seen. He's gonna get shot at. All right, come on. Oh, he's got to be in their sights. I can. Right, oh, he sees one. He's taking shots. I just dropped one. I just dropped one. Aim lower. Aim a little lower. Wait, get him. Oh, he just took a one tap. Done. Down. Sorry, son. Command three here. We have direct, we have 
He tried. I don't know what he was doing. He's got to keep shooting, man. My guys yeah. ran right into him. Copy. Uh, did they get a number? Wait, Who what? was that? That was Karma Cut. Karma Cut one tapped him. Oh, and he actually he ended up getting that guy. He actually ended up getting the guy that uh, that he shot at initially. So good for him there, but did take a one tap. His medic's alive. His medic's healing himself. You know what? But that was a that was a good sacrifice that he made. He, he made a one for one trade and exposed that enemy team to the north, which includes the command. Now this medic is going smoke happy. Oh, he's smoking himself out. He's like, I want to get away too. I want to live. Oh, it fell through the map. I think his smoke did. See if that medic waits it out. Who is this? Yeah, yeah, anyway? we got smokes to our, our west. Yeah. Got smokes to our west. Come close. Smokes to our west. Come close. Jax is running. A lot of Russians. He's getting away. That medic's getting out of there. Harpy's sneaking up on Dessa's squad here, and he's got like two or three guys behind him. Looks like they're going to sweep around and get him from behind. Oh, wow. Open up a little too soon, but it looks like they got two of the Russians. Where are we at kill wise? Oh. It's 16 to 17. It's like anybody's game. This is anybody's, and it's getting haywire. I don't even know where to look anymore. I'm just kind of following what battle I can. Yeah, there's just engagements all over the place. There's like three or four different engagements going on right now. Some of the militia are trying to fall back and cover each other. Yeah, some of the militia are falling back from that northern push. Trying to get back to a little more solid cover. Oh my gosh! That whole squad got wiped! Oh, that southwest push just got tankered. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Good job. Nobody was watching to the east, and they just snuck right up on them. One, what's your friend like over there? One Russian left over here. I'll repeat that. I'll repeat that. What's the pressure like over there? How many contacts are you still trying to engage? Uh, we killed just about every one of them. Only one of them escaped that fell down there. Right? Copy that. And just work. like that, Militia have the advantage. They took out that full squad. What a valiant push. I wish we would have caught that. I'm just outside here, at Oh, and look at that. The only one left down here is Poke Spot from Odessa squad. He's got three dudes to kill. Cantador's coming up on him. Oh, Poke Spot's going to hear him. He's looking the wrong way, though. Oh, he doesn't hear him. Oh no. Oh, he's right on him. He what? walks up right on him. He didn't even what? see it. Oh, wow. <laughs> I guess that'll happen every now and then. Well, the rest of the, his team must know that the guy's down there. Perhaps yeah, not, though. And it looks like they're moving this way. Militia shooting north and now at the remainder Russians. There's full squad coming in from the north northwest. Boy, I don't know what Canador was doing there, and folks might hurt him. It was a little too late, but it worked out in his favor. See, a lot of what I'm not seeing right now is the, the Russians are, they're making big moves. They're making a lot of big moves, but they're not making any slow moves. Like, okay, they're getting shot at. That's great. But they don't, they don't need to completely change location. They just need to, to move a little bit side to side. Right. Shoot and scoop. Yeah, 
And it's actually, they're doing something good now. One, one guy is still getting shot at. The rest of them are... That's totally viable. That's good strategy. Here they come again, making a push from that east side. Coming down the eastern side of the... Oh, I'm running low oh so, someone's going to shoot Shadow Ritual. Who is it? Karma Cut's going to shoot Shadow Ritual. Reload. He's going to see him. Uh, oh, he, oh, he saw him. This guy just saw him. Mikolaj Slave just saw Karma Cut as he's reloading. He turned to talk to Shadow Ritual and he saw him down there. He freaked out. He said, contact. That was great. That was great. Oh, now they're taking shots. Full squad over there. All right, this is Karma Cut. Oh, Karma Cut's down. Who just got him? Google Trex got Karma Cut. He's got the other. He didn't get the other, though. Oh, somebody got yep, him. There are two or three. Two or three, I can't tell. I got one of them. I got Good one job. Of them. Wow, that's that sight. That just that one, one spot just saved their team. Is that a grenade? Is that a grenade? That no, was great. I loved yeah, hearing that. that. I loved three. watching we, that go uh, down. We got eyes on from awesome. uh, compound two. I can't engage them. That's about it. There's not much left for. One, yeah. One, follow the uh, follow the edge and swing around and, and cover the uh, west side of the uh, the peninsula. Just start walking along that west side. And just keep me updated what you see. We think we've dealt with all contacts on the west. I just need you to just double check. Uh, we think the remaining. A lot of good teamwork going on here. I'll tell you what. A lot of great teamwork. Out by smoke. Here in Overcomps, people are about to be out of ammo. There has been a ton of exchange in gunfire. Holy sawfire. Grenades being thrown. That saw is empty in his drum mag. He's doing it with absolutely no consideration for anything. He's just shooting north. Oh, one tap. Someone just making Google tracks, putting some good shots down again. One on the bank there. That's his fourth kill. Good job. Gotten two or three on that bank. Oh, more good shots coming from the militia. Shadow right Ritual yeah. just took one out. No, that's Google uh, tracks taking another yeah, one out. He's got five. He must have watched me earlier today. <laughs> Alright, squad one's coming in. West seems to be clear for now. Copy. Uh, change plans. Oh, Militia's pushing north. back. They're north. actually moving yeah, north. Pushing back. Who we got left? I don't, I'm not going to worry about our watch name. Piddle? Van? Boy. Yeah, yeah, kill the Rush is getting low. Yeah. Rush is getting low. I think Poke Spot's on the other side of the map somewhere, too. He's way over there. Yeah, we got two here, and folks following that Western little fire team back in. Yeah, boy, Russia turned it around. Yeah, we got Van. Ammo check, everybody. How's everybody doing? One, be careful pushing up that hill. Yeah, that was there were there were a couple guys up there. They may have pushed off. Copy. I'm almost black on mag. Oh, good shooting. 
Piddle takes out Sneaky Sniper. Oh, he might have just got someone else, too. He got Brevin. Piddle getting dirty. Things happen. Going places. Here we go. Look at these guys right there, just corner of the wall. Oh, here we go. Van drops one. Wow. Google Trex finally bites the bullet. Oh, but he hit him. That one, he's bandaging. There's still one militia soldier outside. Oh, and there they are. Taking shots. Oh, one gets dropped. Russian down. The other one's walking right into him. He's down as well. We got one guy left. It's Poke Smot. Where is he at? You guys got two contacts. There he's he just is. South, south of the fortress here, sneaking up. <laughs> I think he ran across the river. He said the hell with it. Across the river. <laughs> no, he was. He moved all the way around the bridge and uh, moved up. The, oh, uh, nice, dude. That's awesome. Yeah, right, he's following those other guys in. See how we can do. He's got himself a few kills. He's in thick of it. He's still alive. Got himself too. He's coming in. He's on the compound already. He knows he's the last one alive. Oh, Ooh. down. That's GG. He got got. Vector scope got him at the end. Good game. Holy cow, and that saw magic. Oof, that was loud. I was right there next to a saw. Hey guys, thanks so much for coming out. This is Operation Mistwalkers, the first time. We're gonna grab the uh, commanders, get them in here for a little after action report, see what they feel about the strategies and how they worked out. So give us just a second. We're going to talk it out. See how these guys think they did. I thought we had some good strategies going tonight. Close matches. Yeah, the second round was full of a whole lot of maneuvering. All right, we got it. We got Karma Cut here. We're just going to wait on you at a ritual. Hello. Well, hi, Karma. Hi. So how about the end of that second round? That was good. You guys had that flank coming in. Man, you ought to see it. You were so lucky that the militia guy spotted you. He was, like, talking to Shadow Ritual. You were looking. Oh, yeah. We could tell they were laxing up because they were pushing out. And the only time you push out and check an area is when you think it's clear. So we were like, oh, we're going to get these guys as they get closer. Uh, but someone got spotted. Um, but, yeah, it was a great, it was a great game. I think uh, one of the tactical errors is... As we get closer and closer, it's really hard to flank that initial bunker. You have to take that bunker. And I think uh, moving forward, if we ever play this off, uh, I think one of the first things you got to do is take that first bunker. Just get up next to it and frag it. <clears throat> oh, of course. Of course, that, that definitely matters. Making sure you clear out those areas where you're not sure of. And I'll tell you what, you guys just, the comms and the coordination was just amazing in that second round. You guys had guys going everywhere, running all over the place, reacting to each other. It was hard to follow. There was so much going on, we could hardly follow, could we, Expit? Yeah, it was like a lot of different little engagements going on. A lot of suppressive fire going on. 
it's the two squads to the north and two squads to the south that was best pony across the uh, river holding that southern bridge and he was like oh they're just wasting all their ammo on me <laughs> yeah you both did a great job that was awesome it was, it was a good time i did enjoy it There was one squad that pushed in from the southwest, I think it was, in the second round. They got completely wiped. I didn't see it, but those those poor Russians definitely got. Oh, taken the out. Uh, the northern squad. Yeah, yeah, the northern. Yeah, the, we were the up first there. One, the next one. We spun around and we saw the whole squad ready to ambush our northern squad, and we were screaming over command comms um, that it was about to happen, and and it was just a, I think a couple seconds too late. Yeah, that's. I just saw in chat someone said, "Stop with the river pushes." <laughs> they both got wrecked. <laughs> well, there's not a lot you can do. There's a river there. You have to work with it a little bit. So. Mm -hmm. Easier said than done for the most part. But regardless, what a good couple of rounds. So, do you have anything to add? No, I mean, it's, you know, I when I envision the op, this is kind of exactly what I envision. A bunch of little engagements happening off the point. Everybody trying to get to the same objective, so. I, it worked great. It's a lot of fun. I, I was able to play in the first one. Blast. A lot of fun. Look forward to playing it again in the future. Yeah, look forward to playing more infantry-only ops. They, they allow for a lot um, more planning and, and longer engagements, I think. Yeah, the engagements are longer. There, there's less... There's more movement, but for less distance. Mm -hmm. It almost seems like you have to cover every angle almost all the time. Yep. So it's great. It's great. We saw some guys do that really well, and we saw uh, other guys struggle with it. And it just kind of worked out the way it did. There's so many different ways that you could get approached from. It just depends where you're looking at the time it happened. And everybody's complaining about not having enough ammo. <laughs> Which is great. That makes it even better. That really does. You know, it's actually something you have to worry about is running out of ammo. That, that's awesome to hear. You know, I've only got, I've got two orange mags, that's it. You know, I love hearing that on comms. It's like, oh, they got to conserve it now. Make them shots can. So yeah, that's awesome. but yeah, it's great. Well, thanks for coming out afterwards. You guys did a great job commanding, and I look forward to seeing both of you command more. Thank you. Yeah, well, definitely right. a great time in uh, commanding this up. It was definitely a fun one. All right, well, we'll let you go, and we'll let, we'll let most everybody go, I suppose. Thanks for watching so much. You can check us out at squadops.gg. You can always check us out at YouTube, uh, squadops, switch.tv slash squadops. We're, we're around. A lot of fun. We have a Discord. Ask any questions there. Can we plug the giveaway? We're doing a giveaway the month. We're, we're every month, uh, yeah. You have the... Uh... Yeah, every month, the other month. Get signed me, up. Uh, yes. Squad key giveaway every month. Uh... Where's the link? There's the link. Karma Cut's gonna provide it. It's definitely been appearing throughout the whole, whole stream on Twitch. It so has it. Okay. Yeah, the people have seen it for sure. I hope. Everyone, I hope you all win. All at the same time. I hope this is a glitch. You all win. <laughs> thank Karma. <coughs> <laughs> yeah. Thank you so much for having me, and uh, we'll see you guys next time. All right, guys. We'll see you next time. We'll catch you on uh, Wednesday for the next operation. Until then, we'll let you go. My name's Muff, here with XBit. Thank you so much, Pen. Thank you so much, Karma, Shadow Ritual, everybody involved, and we're going to see you later fade out. Bye-bye. <laughs>